technical analysis review. But today I want to check out BGXX. Here's why bright green BGXX stock price soared 71%. Ladies and gentlemen, this has been updated to for today, I guess. Updated September 1st, 2022. Key points, the bright green BGXX stock price soared 71% pre-market. Traders are pushing BGXX stock higher on past announcements. What are those announcements, my friends? Don't worry, we got you. So should you buy right should, should you buy bright green stock? So let's read on and let's find out. The bright green corp stock price soared 71% as momentum traders push the BGXX stock price higher following recent positive developments. One of the latest announcements from the company includes the recent partnership with Alterola Biotech, which is set to conclude in the acquisition of Alterola Biotech by Bright Green. Bright Green committed to spending $4 million to purchase up to 25% of Alterola Biotech's current outstanding shares, with an additional $6 million being paid once Bright, bright Green completes the ongoing due diligence process. The company announced its new partnership with Alterola two days ago, triggering a frenzy of buying activity as investors rush in to secure a stake in the cannabis company, which promises to carve a unique niche for itself in the growing industry. Bright Green announced its second quarter earnings results on August 22, 2022, highlighting its listing on the Nasdaq exchange, which gives it access to the public markets where it can access funding from issuing shares to interested investors. The funds raised via stock issuance usually do not need to be repaid, nor do they accrue interest like the funds raised via loans, such as convertible notes and bonds that must be repaid and tend to accrue interest over time. Bright green shares rallied 71.7% pre-market as traders aggressively bought the shares with over 4.11 million shares changing hands at writing. So, should you buy bright green shares as they are rising? The short answer for most people is no! Most investors should not chase a stock higher since significant pullbacks always follow such moves. And I agree. However, Momentum and other short-term traders may find it profitable to chase stock prices higher since they look to make quick profits sometimes in seconds, unlike most investors who hold their positions for multiple days. This is not an investment advice. Always do your due diligence before making investment decisions. Ladies and gentlemen, and BGXX pre-market Bright Green Corporation, from 139, we are up to 182. 30%, 0.42. If you look at the monthly, we close bearish, but with a wick on the bottom of the candle, which signifies or significa buying pressure. The weekly close bullish engulfing, which I see it was a great candle. And you can see that the daily actually went up to 185 right now, guys. So we are up 33%, 46 cents. And just to give a little bit more clarity, bright green signs, letter of intent will alter all our biotech on shares purchase. So cannabis company bright green, BGXX, has signed a letter of intent with the UK-based pharmaceutical company Alterola Biotech to purchase the latter's issued and outstanding common stock. BGXX will initially purchase 25% of Alterola shares for $4 million, subject to completion of initial satisfactory due diligence and other customary conditions. It will then receive a six-month option to purchase the remaining shares for an additional $6 million, also subject to several factors. Alterola is set to gain access to Bright Green's plant cannabis and cannabis extracts, derivatives, products, and research services as part of of the agreement and let's do a quick technical analysis guys so we can see that our highs were at 57.94 which is kind of crazy our lows let's go ahead and do that real quick the lows over here at one dollar 
and there's not a lot of information that we can use for BGXX, but we see a resistance of 286, and we see this support at 220s, and that's about it. There's not a lot of information for us to go around with. Uh, 266, I see that the 50 exponential moving average is there. You look to the left, it does match with the area of resistance, so it's a strong zone. Keep an eye on it, but remember guys, when we get these gaps, we usually get to close them. Why? Because that's how the market works. And short-term investors will get in, get out. Looking at the daily, we were a little bit oversold. The 4-hour was more oversold over here at 108, so that was the opportunity. You can see over here at $1 on the 1-hour time frame. And I'm starting to see the 200 EMA. So if we stay above, it will be a great sign. We do want to see this stay above the 200 EMA. But if there's any pullbacks, it can go back to 160s and even back down to 130s. Okay? Let me know in the chat room. Let me know in the comment section below. Did you enter BGXX? Definitely interested. But great news for those who enter. Keep kicking booty. We do the videos con mucho, mucho amor. As always, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, ring the bell so you get notified every time we are online. Let me go ahead and...